we had a poster uh, at ASCO where we were able to do a, 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 a presentation um, that was entitled Safety Outcomes of Darolutamide versus Apalutamide and Enzalutamide in Non-Metastatic Castration-Resistant Prostate Cancer uh, Match Adjusted Indirect Comparisons. And this is a, a rather sophisticated but very interesting methodology which allows us to uh, look at the published literature uh, from the, the uh, Spartan and PROSPER trials, uh, as well as the database that we had for the Aramis trial. All three of these drugs have now been approved by most regulatory bodies for non-metastatic castration-resistant prostate cancer, yet there have been differences in how they report their adverse event safety and tolerability profiles. So with the um, uh, match-adjusted indirect comparison methodology, it allows us an opportunity to uh, have an analysis and see, granted, it's, it's not as, uh, uh, as provocative as doing a prospective direct comparator trial, but we came to the following conclusions in using this methodology with uh, a, a rather rigorous and careful um, statistical and analytical evaluation. So I'll just basically give you the conclusions of our poster. Our poster goes into great detail regarding the methodology and the data that we were able to analyze. I think for, for brevity, let me just uh, highlight our conclusions for you. Um, uh, that the adjusting for trial differences and with multiplicity of testing, uh, darolutamide exhibited a, a more favorable safety profile when compared to apalutamide and enzalutamide. Uh, darolutamide had a statistically significant lower risk of falls, fracture, and rash compared to fatigue and severe, severe fatigue compared to enzalutamide. And again, I want to reiterate that head-to-head -head trials are the gold standard for comparative clinical evaluation. Our results, we feel, are informative uh, uh, for the, the patient-physician shared decision-making that we currently have. I do think it's important to do additional prospective trials.